you are working on a site, you have a whole bunch of sections, but you need different background colors on them. So you add the class that you need. It adds the color that you needed, but you have a problem. It is stuck inside of a container or wrapper. Well, there is a solution. So first I'm just gonna come here and add a full bleed. And then let's come over to my CSS. And we're gonna do the create that class. And just really fast, this tip came to me from Tamani from CSS Challenges. I have linked to them in a pinned comment. So the first thing we're going to do is a box shadow. And for this box shadow, we want to have zero for everything, but 100 V max for the spread. And when we give this a background color, you're going to see it's just going to cover the entire page. Now to solve this, what we need to do is come and give this a clip path. And for the clip path, we give that an inset of zero and negative 100 V max. And if we come and take a look, we can see that that has set things up perfectly. It makes a full bleed background coming out of the container. And one limitation of this is the background color has to be the same, but we could use custom properties to solve this by using a custom property for both of them. If I came here and make a change, it will update both of them at the same time and everything works 